six days, four whole days, I will see you in Istanbul. Good morning, so we have got to Istanbul and got a quick breakfast and then today is all about the like classic historical area. The Sultanahmet, the Blue Mosque at Hagia Sophia. Like genuine pistachio-y, like I'm definitely coming back. Been to Spice well, Bazaar, we've got some Ottoman sweet spice and spicy spice. Yeah. Turkish coffee as well. Arrived at Van Kamalti. We've got some bread to start, Turkish breakfast for 130 lira each. It looks absolutely massive. It's like filling the whole table. I think this is going to be a pretty long, long haul, yeah. Oh my god. That um, was... I'm so full. We ate for like over an hour, just like non stop. Honestly, I feel like I'm gonna die. That's a really good deal, I think. And they kept asking if you want more bread, and you get unlimited tea. Quality ingredients I thought was really good, but everything's very fresh. Yeah, it, it was just really, really good, so I would recommend. But now we're gonna go see some palaces, see a mosque, I think a rock coin mosque, go along the river edge, so I'll do a big loop. It's like a pretty standard palace, but then you get to the last room. The last room is really impressive, but you can't take photos, and there's even a security guard to stop you. I have no idea what we thought, but it's chaos. It's absolute chaos. It's as close as you can get to just eating pure Nutella. The pastry is so thin that it's basically just Nutella. 10 lira. It's 215 lira. There's a, uh, there's a big queue. We're quite hungry. I think we gotta leave it. But it is a cool tower. If I didn't have anything else to say today, I would have done that. It is on a Sunday and it is absolutely packed. We're gonna get a wet burger. Oh my god, look, that guy's is scooping all of the fat into a little cup. We had a meatball sub, but it done really like mushy. You'd overcook the meatballs. That's quite nice. I like that. Very cheap as well. So it's day three. Today is primarily to see the Asian side. We're going to Uskada, but first we're going to see Top Kapi Palace. Get the boat across. See some mosques on that side. Wander around the neighbourhood. It's really hot. I'm in chinos. I'll see you when I'm sunburned. We made it. Kamlika Gami. It's huge. So it's the biggest mosque in Turkey. It looks like a mosque on top of a mosque.
So we watched a nice sunset, went back to the European side, went for some Uyghur, Turkish, Chinese food, which was nice. We're trying to find some Turkish delight. We've literally not been able to escape it the entire time. As soon as you want some, there's none to be found. Right, so day four, we are going to Princess Island. Just off the coast of Istanbul, it's supposed to be a nice island, you cycle around, let's get a chill day. So we're nearly at the island, and Nicole got suckered into a quite impressive presentation, shall we, but she bought a potato peeler because this bloke peeled a pineapple with it. Look at those spikes, is that zoom? Is, that is this getting on the plane? Absolutely not. Where are you? It's very peaceful, there's only electric vehicles on here. Oof. Found some to pee. We're also getting lunch here, so we've got this aubergine dish. We've got some homemade hibiscus and lemonade. Yum, yum, yum. These houses are crazy. Ice cream break. This is quite creepy. Greek orphanage. It's the largest building in Europe, made completely of wood. And it's just what horror films are made of, really, isn't it? <clears throat> on the Asian side, 200 grams of Turkish delight for 11 lira. We're at the airport. It's mental, actually. It's massive. Doing a good trip. My tips. Don't really bother with Uber taxis. They're just on the meter and they're pretty cheap. Asian side's way cheaper. 15 lira to get across by boat. You don't need to bother being in Sultanahmet. you are only got to be there for a day. <laughs> Goes to the mosques in the evening. They stay open later than, like, the tourist stuff. Try the different foods. And yeah, explore, no mistakes. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe. It's really easy. It's like one button. And I will see you later.